public debate over a proposed project near South Surrey is heating up. What they're promising is unacceptable to us. Andean, in partnership with Semiamu First Nation, is proposing to develop and operate a commercial scale waste organics to renewable natural gas facility. The proposed location for the biofuel plant is behind me here on Semiamu First Nation land, close to the Peace Arch border crossing. We oppose this concept for several reasons. First and foremost, our environment. Suzanne Smith, who lives nearby, says she and others are concerned. The proposed plant will cause unpleasant odors, worsen air quality and increase traffic. Smith says an environmental protection notice from Metro Vancouver, published on September 21st in Peace Arch News, is very concerning. It lists emission estimates for the plant. These are major health concerns leading to respiratory illness, long-term effects, cancer. The plant is, is doing good for our environment, uh, producing renewable energy and managing waste that we all produce. The CEO of Andean Global says the biofuel plant is safe and meets all regulatory requirements. When some of the citizens got hold of these air dispersion models, unfortunately, you know, they're, they're very difficult to, to sort of interpret. Um, and perhaps were led to conclusions that there was this sort of toxic fumes coming from the plant, but there is no such thing uh, in terms of that. And, and keeping in mind all the modeling we did ignores all of the background uh, pollutants in the air that already exist. Surrey City Councillor Linda Annis says her office has received hundreds of letters from citizens worried about the proposed plant. They're concerned about the traffic, they're concerned about the air pollutants and the noise, of course. Annis says the city of Surrey doesn't have a say in the project, but is urging the Semiamu First Nations chief, Harley Chappelle, to rethink the proposed facility. I applaud uh, Chief uh, Chappelle for moving forward with economic development for the Semiamu First Nations folks, but people have been speaking out and quite loudly. City News reached out to the Semiamu First Nation for comment, but they were unavailable. The community needs to learn for themselves the facts and not jump to conclusions on this. Uh, there will be a public information session on November the 8th um, around this project. A biofuel facility like this should be located on industrial land outside of 10 kilometres of any residential area. Smith is planning to hold a rally at Peace Arch Park in Surrey on Sunday to stop the proposed plant. In Surrey, Angela Bauer, City News.